What is going on folks, Antoine here, and today we're going to be taking a look at AT&T's at and TV set-top box TV service. Now in this video, we're going to be going over the pricing, and you know, hopefully we get some of the questions answered that you guys might have out there about the service. Um, I went in-depth in an article on my website, you know, I also chatted with the AT&T online support team trying to get you know the majority of the questions that I feel that people might have about this service answered so let's go ahead and get into it folks so first thing we're gonna take a look at it what's the difference between AT&T TV and AT&T TV now now um, the difference is AT&T TV requires you to have a set top box with AT&T TV now all you simply do is download the app and you can watch the TV from anywhere you're not required to you know be set at one place so with that question uh, with, with that statement that's something I want to confirm with the at and chat team so um, let's see if this service work work outside my home and Uh, you know, let's rephrase that character service. Can I take the set top boxes? Uh, you know what? Let's rephrase that. Can I use the set top boxes outside my home? Now, um, this uh, chat person right here has been extremely helpful. I've been chatting with him over the past couple of days, just trying to get some questions answered, and, you know, they have been there. So we're going to come back to that, but just move on. So with this service, you want to get more channels than you get with AT&T TV. Now, we're going to get to the channel lineup in a second, but I just want to go through some of the important things first. So... Just browse down here to devices and pricing. So there's no credit check. Now, when you do sign up, the devices, the main, the, the devices do share the same DVR storage, and with that, you get 500 hours of cloud DVR storage, and you are allowed up to six devices per account. Now, the thing with that is only three concurrent AT&T streams are allowed per account. That means the other three devices will either have to watch Netflix or Hulu, which these apps are available on the set-top boxes that you get from AT&T. Now, as far as you know, the receiver fees or whatnot, you can lease the owner device or receiver for ten dollars a month, or you can buy them outright for a hundred and twenty dollars each. So you know that's a pretty hefty price right there, but. You know, they still, they're giving you the option to just buy them out. That way you don't have to pay a monthly fee for it. And that brings another question I would like to ask. Um, I would like to know if you can still use these devices when you don't have the service. Just to clarify, when you say outside your home, are you referring to another thing? Yes. You know, a lot of questions come up when, you know, when you kind of just move on. So, you know, I'm glad they got this chat feature right here. So, um, I'm going to ask her, can I still, let me see, can the receivers be used if I... No, all right, let's get this question answered. So, um, can you watch it outside your home? No, you will not. However, you can install the TV app on your smart device in order to stream your channels away from home. So, let's ask you what app? And you know, this is how it is when you 
you know dealing with a new service especially a service like this you know this service um mimics um satellite tv right two-year contract set top boxes the cooler thing is there's no wires but you know get back to the answer that's the AT&T TV now app so um it looks like and this is something I didn't know the AT&T TV app is I guess similar to the AT&T TV now service so which is cool so let me, oh, that brings up this question And you know, again, uh, I hope she stick around for this because I'm about to get into a, a quite a few questions here. Um, let's see what kind of answer we get right here. So is AT and T TV the same as AT and T TV? Now, um, I probably could have worded that different, but because you probably she probably thinking about how to answer it. Um, and you know this is a real person um, because the last couple of times I chatted you know they'll be right there just waiting to chat and you know I ask them is this a real person uh, they say yes and I asked her again she answered it differently so um, yeah this is this is a real person I don't know what part of the world they're in but you know it doesn't matter they get an answers question questions answer AT&T look at that 3T is now as mentioned above as an app so <clears throat> I really don't my next question I'm thinking about actually so if I cancel AT&T TV will I so let's go ahead and so if I think she's gonna get into salesman mode if I answer too many questions. She probably gonna ask for my address, and I already entered my address, and it is not available in my area. I don't want to lose her, so I really don't want to get into some that many questions because I asked. She asked me that yesterday, and I had to kind of you know step back and get back on. But um, what was the question I was gonna ask her? Uh. So, um, does this make sense to y'all? AT and T now is mentioned as mentioned above is an app. So, all right, we know they're not the same. All right, there she go. She she deferred me to the um to the grave to the coffin. She, she getting rid of me. I guarantee you she will be back and I didn't forget the question I was going to ask her about um, the set top box okay if I deactivated okay um, can the set top boxes be used without ATT TV service service for use of to access other streaming can they can the set top boxes be used without ATT service used if I cancel to access other stream apps like Hulu. All right, this is a confusing question. I know she, she got a job she got to do, so this could be a he. We don't know. That's just a photo. Okay, so she just frankly said that. Okay, thank 
use. So if you if you cancel the service, you can still use it as a streaming device. So that was the that was the answer I was looking for on that one. So let's get back to the programming and um, other things. So three concurrent streams again. Only three people can watch it at one time. The other three people, if you do get the full gamut, the six devices, um, the other three people will have to access Hulu or Netflix. So it requires a high-speed internet. Like I said before, you, there's no wires. It works strictly off internet connection. Right? So right here we get into the um, the fine print, you know, that was on their website. Just kind of blew it up and just took out some of the major parts so that, you know, I feel that'll be important to people. So um, minimum eight megabytes per screen for optimal viewing, which isn't a lot. Most cable and even satellite um, download speeds are, you know, way more than that. 25, 35, you know, 150, 200 megabytes per second. So, so we get into the pricing. This is where it kind of gets confusing. Um, Let's go ahead and that is all. So, of course, we're going to give her the thumbs up. We're not going to leave a comment. Mm, I'm to you and I hope you. Uh, thank you for your feedback. Um, close chat. And thumbs up is already there. So, let's get back to it. So, when it comes to the pricing, um, this is where it get kind of kind of confusing because each um, service had a different price. And again, entertainment package forty nine ninety nine, fifty four ninety nine, sixty nine ninety nine. Different prices, different price and different packages. But right here, this is kind of like a um, you know first and second year pricing seventy four seventy nine ninety nine a month. You know blah blah blah. But pretty much just to boil this down, whatever they are giving you, just like with satellite or cable if they're giving you any promotional deal there are certain requirements requirements so if they're if you're signing up for this service of course you're going to need to have the internet so um if you get at&t internet which that's what i should ask her is a well she i think she answered that at&t internet is required so if you cancel at&t internet you're not going to get the promotional pricing anymore that's something you need to that's something you need to know. If you go down here, you can, you can look through it, read it over. Um, it's all there. So if you cancel that, cancel any promotional, you cancel anything that's required, you know, there that's going to avoid your promotional pricing. And you're going to get charged the regular price, which is it's steep. It's steep, folks. It's real steep. It's like the amount of an electric bill. All right, so right here, maintain a bundle of TV and Internet in order to receive unlimited data allowance at no additional charge. So that's something else to think about, too, or you need to know. That's why I put that in bold. I put, you know, most of the bullet points in bold. Internet is built separately. Must maintain all qualifying service to receive advertised price. So let's go down to the packages and the pricing. So get to the meats and the bolts of this right here. Yeah, you could you want to visit AT&T website, click on this link right here. All right, so first package, this is the cheapest package. This is the internet payment package. And folks, when you visit my website otantana.com, there's going to be a section over here in the 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 right sidebar. And you just type for any channel that you're looking for um AMC and then you press search it's going to bring up you know services that i have on my website that have that channel so um you know again it was still loading so bt just going down here so whatever so we got friendly friendly probably don't have bt but philo tv has bt and um once you hit search just look for a streaming service it's gonna it's gonna show you what service offers that channel right there that's directly from my website give it a try you know of course i don't have every last streaming service on my website but that's something i'm building on and working to get then i'm going to take it from there and see what else i can do so just going through the channels you have a and e and you know 
some pretty decent channels right here but if I was to just do a quick comparison um, a couple weeks ago I did a review of Fubo TV I did an updated review on Fubo TV and even VitGo um, they are you know around the same YouTube even YouTube TV is around the same price point but you you know you're going to get um, the channels you want right so right here um, we're getting AMC um, I didn't see IFC in here and also folks if you on this web page hit command F or control F right command F or control F it's going to enter the, the find bar and you just type in what channel you looking for IFC so you know at t doesn't carry IFC but if we go to AMC it's going to highlight it for us you know that's your search function control F or command F and it's going to take you to that so I'm just going to browse through here so the next package up is the choice package that's $54.99 per month and um, the choice package the channels that have been added for the choice package are going to be in bold print so you're going to get a wealth of entertainment ACNC, ACCN network game show Longhorn um, network um, service I just reviewed had Longhorn in it already without any animals I forgot that it might have been Vitgo it's, it's either Vitgo or Philo but I'm going down just browsing through so something you want to know is choice package does not include revolt TV or ovation so every other package has revolt and ovation but oh, um, the choice package does not have them channels so we're just going going down to the extra package and you know based on the chats I had this is the highest package you can get with AT&T TV but you know per their website this is not you know uh, if we just look right here if we go to their website they have a, a ultimate plus and max I got on the chat and I asked him about that and he said you can only access them packages with AT&T TV now so you know like I said it's a new service so maybe they maybe the customer service no, no maybe they don't you know I'm I'm pretty sure they probably don't don't know you know pretty much you know frankly put it so just going down here um, through the extra package so you have the extra package channels are in the bold blueprint so golf channel is included FXM American Heroes now um, Discovery Family you know just going on Lifetime Movies um, again, it was another service I reviewed. You can either find a video or just type in Lifetime Movies and um, in my search panel and see what service pop is. It was a service I just reviewed um, last month that has all of those channels in one package. If you're into that, Longhorn, Outdoor Channel, Great American Heroes, um, it's a cheaper package out there that offers that. Um, but Cartoon Network West is only available in this package cartoon network west if that's the channel you got to have it's only available in the extra package so we're going to go down to here so again the ultimate package was 64.99 um it's going down here i believe it was 69.99 right yeah 69.99 that was a typo um going back up here the plus package 110 a month includes HBO. The max package 130 a month includes HBO, Cinemax, and more sports channels. Now, this has come directly for the AT&T TV website. Again, bop, 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 bop. You get down to these package. Well, they don't go into details about the channels. So that's what my chat was about. I was asking them what, and the chat is not here anymore. I was asking them, I'm not able to see what channels are included in the max plus and ultimate package that's when he said those are only available on AT&T TV now but who knows if you have AT&T TV and you're getting these packages let us know what channels are included or you know if you have the time right so let's go down to the add-ons so they have different add-ons and the add-ons are actually not that bad of a deal 
so you get epics that's six dollars extra per month and these are the epics channels you get hbo fifteen dollars a month those are the channels you get uh, nba league packs premium forty dollars per month cinemax eleven dollars per month stars eleven dollars at&t deportes five dollars at&t espanol 15 movies extra package is five dollars a month then they also offer international packages brazilian korean and vietnamese now one thing about them is they do offer a spanish package so we just go over here they have one spanish package i did link that on my web page so you could just browse through right here and see what channels they offer in Spanish. Um, if any of those look familiar to you and you want to sign up, go ahead and click on the link. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for today. Um, again, if you have any more questions, you can go to ATT.tv and hit up the chat section. But that is it, folks. I will catch you guys next time. Peace out.